Hi guys, it's Annie from Eclipse All Sports and I'm just wanting to give you a look at one of the Arebus cricket bats that is not currently listed on our website. Um, so basically, um, I'm going to be listing this one shortly and just wanting to do a quick video review of it for you. You're looking at 16, 17 grains and uh, you've got a little bit of hardwood on the right and this outside edge. As you can tell, it's a nice looking bat. Um, one of these bats was um, purchased by Chad and he's done a review on the custom bats forum. Um, he was quite impressed with the bat. And the only criticism that he had um, was the stickers uh, lifting, uh, especially these back stickers lifting and bubbling. Um, and that's basically due to the, the high spine. Uh, it was quite sharp and high and there wasn't much surface area for the stickers uh, to actually stick to. Um, so what we've done on this one um, if you can see there's no lift in there basically we've just flattened the spine a little bit so it's not as sharp and as pointy um, I don't know if you can tell there um, so there's a little bit more surface area um, for the stickers to actually stick to um, so this one now is sticking much better and there's no bubbling and there's no lifting um, so Next year's models, they're going to be fuller profiles, uh, so there's not going to be as much concaving because there is a little bit, well, there's quite a lot of concaving on this particular one and on some of the other ones that we received this year. So we're going to go for a fuller profile. Um, that might mean that the spine height might be reduced or the edge height might be reduced. Currently, this one's got 37, 38 mil edge and you're looking at around about 66, 67 mil spine. Um, so the spine and the edge size might go down a little bit, uh, but the profiles will be fuller and there will be less concaving and if possible no concaving at all because people are starting to prefer the fuller profiles now and me personally I prefer a fuller profile cricket bat. Um, so yeah, we'll be looking to produce those for next season. Um, we fit this one with a double scale grip. You've got a matching um, white toe guard, uh, the spine as you can see it runs down into the toe giving you a very thick toe and it runs all the way up into handle and you've got an oval handle um, so that just helps and you've got a nice nice pickup even though it's a very low middle as you can see from there so we've got a very low swell um, and there's plenty of wood behind that sweet spot so it's ideal for low bouncing wickets in the UK and um, so yeah it's really good for front foot play and driving those uh, low bouncing balls. Um, so if you're one of those players that likes to play on the front foot, uh, but majority of the weeks you're playing on a, a damp wicket that doesn't really bounce, uh, then something like this will be ideal for you. Um, so yeah, we'll just see how it taps up. This instantly weighs 210.8, um, so it's the, the lightest Erebus that we've got left in stock. Um, we've only got three Erebuses left and we've got two Nemesis cricket bats left. And they all come with um, back covers, and they will be oiled, knocked in, anti scuff sheet, edge protection tape fitted, free of charge, and that includes free delivery. And we're currently selling them um, on clearance for £119.99. So you're getting a grade one English Willow cricket bat for £119.99, and that includes full preparation and free UK mainland delivery. Uh, so it's an absolute bargain, guys. You're getting 16, 17 grains on this particular one. Um, so yeah, get yourselves over to the website and pick those up before they're gone. Uh, they won't be listed for much longer, I wouldn't have thought. Um, so yeah, we'll just see how this one taps up and uh, just see what you think. So a really good down low guys, really pinging nicely down low. And there's still plenty of wood up top as that spine runs all the way up through the handle so that just helps distribute that weight all the way up the blade so it means even though it's got it's got quite a bit of concaving and that sweet spot's really long it might not be as wide as some sweet spots due to the concaving but it's much longer and it's been extended um, so you're getting plenty of power right up the blade so you're getting a nice big hitting zone from about there all the way up to about there um, so yeah it's a good performing bat and once it's been oiled and knocked in um, it's gonna get it's only gonna get better guys so yeah it's a great bat and if you like what you see 
um, get yourselves over to the website and pick this one up 119.99 guys I don't think you can uh, do much better than that right thanks for watching guys until next time see you all then bye bye